Since its founding in 2009, San Francisco-based Mission Workshop has served as the preeminent gear supplier for urban cyclists and discerning two-wheeled commuters. And it's not without good reason. The brainchild of Chrome co-founders Mark Flavai and Bart Kazar, it's a brand that balances a cool aesthetic with top-notch technical prowess. All that is to say, when we managed to get our hands on Mission Workshop's wildly popular rake backpack, we knew that we just had to take it out for a spin. At first glance, the rake appears to be a pretty involved backpack, almost intimidatingly so in fact. Between the roll top closure, the exterior compression straps, and the side opening organizational pockets, it's a far cry from the classic book bag concept that we've all come to know. Of course, with added complexity comes added capability, something the rake has in spades. The good news though, is that it's far more intuitive to use than you might expect. Size wise, the rake skews toward the larger side of work backpacks at least insofar as its length is concerned. Measuring some 21 inches tip to tail, 13 inches wide, and five inches deep, it offers a generous 22 liters of interior volume. With everything that's going on around the bag, it clocks in heavier than lightweight options like the Bellroy Transit work pack. However, it's far from a bulky bag at 3.1 pounds unloaded. As much as we try to stay objective when it comes to a bag's aesthetics, we'd be lying if we said that they don't play a big part in what we decide to carry. In typical Mission Workshop fashion, the rake is a stunning piece from a design perspective. It's technical and utilitarian, but also sleek and understated. While we wouldn't choose it for formal office occasions, it's sharp enough that it should work for pretty much anything else. And besides, if you're riding into work, your backpack will be the least of your worries. In keeping with its commuter-ready intentions, the rake features a slew of state-of-the-art materials and components. Oh, and we should point out that it's made right here in the USA. At the core of its construction, you'll find Mission Workshop's proprietary HT500 fabric. Made from a high tenacity 500 denier nylon, it offers nylon unmatched strength qualities for its weight, with the added benefit of a water and stain resistant coating. In hand, the material is smooth and refined, elevated even, but the best part is that it'll develop its own unique patina over time. Much like leather then, this stuff will only get better with age. Around the rest of the bag, Mission Workshop has employed plenty of other top-notch textiles too. As part of the rake's two-layer weatherproof construction, the liner is made from a waterproof nylon. We really like that Mission Workshop opted for a light gray color because it makes the inside of the cavernous main compartment much more visible. That being said, we'd prefer the lining to be sewn to the body. When the bag is fully stuffed, it has a tendency to come out along with your contents. A minor issue, sure but it's something that you shouldn't have to deal with on a $380 plus dollar bag. Given that hardware is a common point of failure for most commuter bags, Mission Workshop has spared no expense when it comes to that on the rake. For starters, all of the exterior zippers are YKK AquaGuard tracks, meaning that they've been stitched into the fabric and coated with a waterproof polymer. Beyond keeping your carry safe from unwanted moisture ingress, they also provide a touch of glossy contrast against the rest of the bag. For the horizontal compression straps, Mission Workshop has opted to use some seatbelt-like nylon webbing in combination with a set of Duraflex buckles. Should you want something a bit more robust, however, you can always upgrade them to a set of 7075 aluminum Cobra quick-release buckles. Alternatively, many users have swapped in Fidlock fasteners on account of their convenience. Last but not least, let's talk about the roll top. In contrast to many bags on the market, the rake can be secured in a number of ways depending on how much space you need. So, in addition to a handy hook and loop closure, Mission Workshop has also included a length of adjustable nylon with an aluminum C-hook to hold it tight. Should you need more room in the expandable main compartment, simply unhook the Velcro and unroll the top of the bag. Some users have even added a longer strip of their own nylon in order to expand the rake's capacity even further. Of course, this does make for some compromises when it comes to waterproofing. One of the hallmarks of Mission Workshop's backpack is its clever internal organization. Where most other roll tops are little more than cavernous catch-alls, the rake instead separates its pockets around the outside. In practice, this makes it incredibly intuitive to pack. At the rear, you'll find a horizontally opening sleeve for stuffing your laptop. We love the easy access, as you don't need to fiddle around with the roll top to get hands on your device. In the main compartment, Mission Workshop has fitted the rake with a deep zippered pocket for keeping track of flatter carry like magazines. Of course, there's also plenty of space for storing other essentials such as over-ear headphones and tech kits. Should you find this pocket a bit too disorderly for your tastes, 
Mission Workshop offers a suite of compatible inserts. Flip up the outer flap, and you'll have access to a deep pocket for dropping in notebooks. Mission Workshop claims this is for iPads and other tablets, though we'd like to see a bit more padding to protect our tech. Out front is where you'll find the most unique aspect of the rig, a pair of buckled, zippered organizational pockets. On one side, there's an integrated leash for attaching your keys, below which Mission Workshop has placed two elasticated mesh compartments. Accordingly, we were able to fit a wallet, a lengthy charging cable, a small knife, and a pair of headphones. And as if that wasn't enough, there's even a zippered organizer on the inner face of the lid, a great catch-all for larger items like pencils, pens, and bottles of hand sanitizer. By contrast, the other pocket is much more bare bones. For this reason, we liked it for bulkier carry, like point-and-shoot cameras. And the innovation doesn't end there. At the base of the bag, Mission Workshop has fitted an expansive accessory pocket for packing away chargers and cables. We love how this keeps cumbersome carry towards the bottom. Finally, there's a hideaway water bottle holster that zips into the bag when not in use. It's a pretty nifty feature, but only time will tell how it holds up to regular use. Being a cycling brand, it goes without saying that Mission Workshop engineers its bags for on-body comfort. Put short, the rake doesn't disappoint. In fact, it's one of the best fitting bags we've tested. The back panel, for instance, is made from a perforated foam in order to insulate you against the bag's contents. It also does a great job of wicking away moisture and keeping you cool, something we really appreciate given the seemingly unrelenting summer heat here in LA. Should you want to carry the bag on your suitcase, Mission Workshop has also fitted the back panel with an integrated luggage handle pass-through. Overall, we really like the design, as it's much more substantial than those typically found on backpacks. If we had one wishlist item, though, it would have to be another mounting point further up the back. Because it sits on your suitcase vertically rather than horizontally, it's up to the shoulder straps to keep it from sliding around. Speaking of the harness system, the straps are super supportive. Thick, wide, and heavily padded, they're very effective at distributing the load. While we'd have liked to see a hip belt, especially on a bag costing nearly $400, the sternum strap helps to relieve some of the weight on your shoulders. Oh, and we should also point out that each strap sports one of Mission Workshop's archive rails. In the event that you need to add more storage capacity or organization, these make it super easy to attach accessories like the cell pocket or the utility pocket. Mission Workshop has built quite the reputation for itself over the years, and the rake is a clear demonstration of its bag-making might. At $380 and up, it's an undeniably expensive backpack, certainly when you consider that it's lacking features like a hip belt. Nevertheless, we'd wholeheartedly recommend the Rake on account of its sharp design, clever organization, and robust build quality, not to mention the lifetime warranty. And thanks to Mission Workshop's ever-expanding roster of accessories, you'll never run out of ways to expand on its potential. Whether you're a hardcore commuter or an aesthetically conscious adventurer, we're confident that this is one bag that's bound to deliver on its promise.